Apple's continuous evolution of its ecosystem is on full display with the latest firmware updates for AirPods and the rollout of iOS 18.4. These changes bring a mix of innovative improvements, potential update challenges, and a glimpse into what's coming next for iPhone and Apple accessory users. Whether you're using AirPods Pro 2, AirPods Max, or AirPods 4th generation, there's a lot to unpack in terms of new capabilities, manual update processes, and system compatibility going forward, new era of AirPods, what these firmware updates really bring. Precision-driven improvements for your AirPods. Apple's AirPods firmware updates may fly under the radar for many casual users, but they play a critical role in refining performance and adding key functionality. The newly released updates, with internal references 7x10 to the power of 93 and 7x10 to the power of 9, mark another leap in Apple's pursuit of seamless user experience. Designed to run in tandem with iOS 18.4, these firmware versions fine-tune AirPods' behavior, particularly for head gesture recognition and automatic device switching, areas where users have long desired smoother interactions. The real game-changer, lossless audio and ultra-low latency. The standout upgrade, especially for audiophiles and professionals, is the introduction of lossless audio and ultra-low latency support, particularly for AirPods Max. These high-fidelity features push AirPods into more premium audio territory, finally delivering what many hoped for since their initial release. However, there's a catch. Only the USB-C variant of the AirPods Max is eligible. Those with the Lightning port model are left out of this upgrade, a decision that may push some users to consider hardware upgrades, OS 18.4, the update that sets the stage. A month of testing, then a public release. After several weeks in beta, iOS 18.4 finally made its way to the general public. While expectations were sky-high, especially around the anticipated rollout of Siri's new personalized intelligence features, the reality was a bit more subdued. Those Siri enhancements were postponed, but the update still delivered several under-the-hood changes and bug fixes that provide a smoother experience across devices. The Update Dilemma – What's Going Wrong? A Bug That Breaks the Process Despite the exciting features, not all users are enjoying a seamless update experience. A known bug within iOS 18.4 is currently preventing automatic firmware installation for some AirPods models. Apple is aware of this issue and is expected to address it in a future update, likely iOS 18.4.1 or iOS 18.5 manually updating your AirPods, step-by-step -step guide. If you suspect your AirPods aren't running the latest firmware, follow this manual method to attempt a forced update. Update your iPhone first, ensure your device is running iOS 18.4 or later. Firmware updates rely heavily on the compatibility layer between your phone and AirPods. Connect to Wi-Fi and plug in, use a stable Wi-Fi connection and plug your iPhone into a power source. Keeping your device charged ensures no interruptions during the process. Prepare your AirPods. Place your AirPods in their case. Confirm they are connected to your iPhone via Bluetooth. Close the lid of the case and leave it near your iPhone for at least 30 minutes. Check firmware version, device-specific features, what each AirPods model gains. AirPods Pro 2 and AirPods 4th generation. These two models benefit most from gesture-based interactions and auto-device switching. Updates enhance the responsiveness of Nod-based controls, which are now more accurate and less prone to false positives. Whether you're navigating playlists, interacting with Siri, or hopping between devices, the experience is significantly smoother. AirPods Max, USB-C version. The AirPods Max with USB-C now enter a new realm of audio excellence with support for lossless audio and ultra-low latency. This makes them more than just premium over-ear headphones. They're now serious contenders for creative professionals who rely on accurate sound reproduction Apple's update cycle. What's next after iOS 18.4? iOS 18.5 a minor step forward. Even before the dust settled on iOS 18.4, Apple had already released the first beta of iOS 18.5. So far, it's a relatively minor update, mostly consisting of performance optimizations and behind-the-scenes tweaks. Future betas may introduce more visible features, but iOS 18.5 currently appears to be an interim update as Apple ramps up development for iOS 19. iOS 19, a major shift in compatibility. One of the biggest changes on the horizon is the rumored drop in support for older iPhone models in iOS 19. According to a reliable leak, the iPhone XR, iPhone XS, and iPhone XS Max will not be compatible with the upcoming OS. 
This marks a departure from iOS 18, which maintained the same device compatibility list as iOS 17 AirPods Max firmware confusion finally settled. There was a brief period of misinformation surrounding the release of the new AirPods Max firmware. Initially, some users thought the update had been cancelled or delayed again. Fortunately, Apple followed through shortly afterward with an official release that confirmed support for high-end audio features, again, only for the USB-C model. Solid-state button rumors still linger. While unrelated directly to AirPods, it's worth noting that Apple hasn't abandoned its plan to integrate solid-state buttons with haptic feedback into future iPhone models. These were once expected to debut on the iPhone 15 Pro, then the 16 Pro, and now potentially even later. Though not tied to any current iOS release, these rumors hint at Apple's ongoing exploration into next-gen physical interface technologies. Apple Watch OS 11.4 also rolls out. Parallel to the iOS update, Apple also released WatchOS 11.4, which adds incremental upgrades for newer Apple Watch models, including the Apple Watch SE 2, Series 6 and above, and both generations of the Apple Watch Ultra. While not as headline-grabbing as iOS or AirPods changes, these updates improve syncing, performance, and some battery optimization. Future Tariffs and the Cost of Apple Products In a geopolitical twist, US tariffs targeting Chinese imports could have a lasting impact on Apple's pricing. With the majority of Apple's assembly operations rooted in China, new import taxes could raise the cost of iPhones, AirPods, and related accessories. Users considering an upgrade may want to act sooner rather than later, depending on how pricing shifts in the coming months. Final Thoughts Embracing the new AirPods experience Despite a few hiccups in the rollout process, Apple's latest AirPods firmware updates mark a significant evolution in wireless audio performance. From improved gesture controls to professional-grade audio fidelity, these features elevate the AirPods lineup in meaningful ways. iOS 18.4 acts as the necessary backbone for these improvements, while iOS 18.5 and iOS 19 look to refine and redefine the Apple experience even further.